Hello viewers, welcome to Mad Tech. I am Amish Sharma. In this video, we are going to solve a question of partial differential equation from CSIR net June 2021. The question is from the topic solution of partial differential equation. So without a delay, let's start. The question is let u x y solve the partial differential equation x square into curly square u by curly x curly y plus 3 y square u equal to 0 with u of x comma 0 is e to the power 1 by x. Which of the following statements are true? Option 1. The partial differential equation is not linear. Option 2. The value of u at 1 comma 1 is e square. Option 3. The value of u at 1 comma 1 is e to the power minus 2. Option 4. The method of separation of variable can be utilized to compute the solution of u x comma y. Now first we discuss the first option. The partial differential equation is said to be linear if dependent variable and all its derivative occur in linear form. Our equation satisfies this condition. This implies the given partial differential equation is linear. This implies option 1 is false. Now we have to discuss the option number 4. Let us take u of x comma y is equal to the function of x into the function of y. We have to assume that this is the solution of the given differential equation. Now curly u by curly y is equal to x into y dash. This implies curly square u curly x into curly y is equal to x dash into y dash. Now substituting all the value in the given differential equation, we have x square into x dash into y dash plus 3 phi square into x into y is equal to 0. This implies x square into x dash into y dash is equal to minus 3 y square x into y. Now separate the variable, we get x square x dash divided by x is equal to minus 3 y square y divided by y dash. Let us take it to be a constant k. Now take first and last term we get x square x dash divided by x is equal to k. This implies the value of x dash by x is equal to k divided by x square. Now integrating both sides we get log of x is equal to minus k by x plus log of c1. Now take the log of c1 into the left hand side we get log of x minus log of c1 is equal to minus k divided by x which is further simplified as log of x divided by c1 is equal to minus k by x. This implies x by c1 is equal to e to the power minus k by x. This implies the value of x is c1 into e to the power minus k by x. Now we have to take the second and the third term we get minus 3y square y divided by y dash is equal to k. After rearranging the term we get minus 3y square divided by k is equal to y dash divided by y. Integrating both sides we get log of y is equal to minus 3 by k y cube divided by 3 plus log of c2. This 3 is cancelled with this 3 and take this log c2 in the left hand side we get log of y minus log of c2 is equal to minus y cube divided by k which is further written as log of y divided by c2 is equal to minus y cube by k. This implies the value of y by c2 is equal to e to the power minus y cube divided by k. This implies the value of y is c2 into e to the power minus y cube by k. Now substituting the value of x and y we get u x comma y is equal to c1 e to the power minus k by x into c2 e to the power minus y cube by k which is further written as c1 into c2 e to the power minus of k by x plus y cube divided by k. This implies u x comma y is equal to c into e to the power minus k by x plus y cube divided by k where c is equal to c1 into c2. This implies the variable separable technique is used to compute the solution of partial differential equation. Therefore, option 4 is also correct. Now we have to find the value of u at 1 comma 1. Now substituting the initial condition u of x comma 0 is e to the power 1 by x. Now the initial condition is u x comma 0 is equal to e to the power 1 by x. For this we have to substitute y equal to 0. This implies e to the power 1 by x is equal to c into e to the power minus k by x. On comparing we get c is equal to 1 and k is equal to minus 1. Now substituting the value of c and k in the solution we get u of x comma y is equal to e to the power minus of minus 1 by x minus y cube which is further written as e to the power 1 by x plus 
y cube. Now we have to find the value of u at 1 comma 1 for this substitute x equal to 1 and y equal to 1. We get e to the power 1 plus 1 which is equal to e square. This implies option 2 is correct and option 3 is wrong. Thank you very much for watching my video. If you like the content, please do like, share and subscribe my channel. If you have any query, comment me. Thank you very much.